you know, we're kind of losing our minds about Trey Lance. Every day we get practice reports. He mm-hmm. threw, you know, two touchdowns. He threw four interceptions. Like, if it, it's crazy to me because I I know that the appetite for Niner football is through the roof, but we are literally over analyzing everything from the way he's tying totally. his shoes to yep. the social media videos. Like, is this all much ado about nothing from your perspective, or is there maybe some nuance that I'm missing? You're, you're a former player. Let me know what you think about these practice reports. So, Joe, I, I, I've been to 12 different training camps this year, and I'm, I'm leaving to go to uh, Miami tomorrow for the Eagles Dolphins scrimmage. So, everybody's going to talk about Tua down there. Yeah. I think it's, I, I, you have to let players just, first of all, nobody knows what any of these drills are. Right. <laughs> and what, what's the, it's designed to do. Yeah. All right. Yeah. And so, like, I don't, I've never, ever, Giving you, well, you know, Trey Lance was uh, 16 for 30 in practice today. <laughs> I've never been that guy that charted any plays. I don't care about it. Yeah. Like, the only thing that's important is his teammates, honestly, and, and the coach. Mm. That's all that matters. Mm. And the organization is behind him. He knows they're behind him. And so, it's like, I'm sure he feels some level of pressure. I mean, this is the 49ers. This is, you know, one of the greatest franchises in NFL history. Like, there is some pressure to play at that position yep. at a high level. So I'm sure he feels some of that. And when he doesn't have a great day, I'm sure he probably it probably bothers him. But Kyle coaches hard. Yeah. Like, he's in, their, he's in his face. He's in his ear when he misses a read, um, makes the wrong call, the wrong check. Like, he's in his ear about all that. He's not letting any of that slide. 